Each week, Cape Media News pays a visit to the MSPCA Animal Shelter at 1577 Falmouth Road in Centerville. This week, we meet adorable adoptables Lovebug and Clover. Lovebug is true to her name. She's a lovebug. She's 10 years old, spayed female Himalayan. She has a short coat right now. Um, her previous owners gave her up, and unfortunately, she hadn't had the best life. She'd been living the last bit in a basement, really, really neglected, and came in covered in urine. She really just has had a tough go of it, and yet is very resilient and hasn't let it change her amazing personality. She's going to be gorgeous, I'll tell you right now. She lived with other animals. She lived with a cat, so she could do well in a home with other cats. We're not sure about dogs, but a calm, I'd say a calm older dog would probably be good. Himalayans, the breed by nature, do have certain chronic issues. Um, she did just have ear infections, so she may need to see a vet regularly to prevent future ear infections. But otherwise, we say above the age of nine, you should go in for annual blood work because cats are very stoic and they won't show pain. So you won't know if anything's happening until it's too late unless you get annual vet care. This is Clover. She is under two years old. She is a lion head, which we know is her little tufts of hair here. She is a little scared right now, but she's the nicest rabbit. She's lived with kids. She lived in a house that had a cat and a dog. So she's basically indestructible. She's a good rabbit for any family. We usually say like rabbits are sensitive, so they might not be a good pet for small kids who don't know how to properly hold them. But she's lived with kids before, so I think even if it was a, a first time rabbit owner, she would be a good choice. Um, they have teeth that are constantly growing, so when you have them for your roaming, you just want to make sure that they're litter box trained, which she is. She does really well using her litter box, and that you pick up anything off the floor that you don't want to through. They do require medical care, which not everyone knows, so you have to take into consideration that they would need to go to the vet as often as a cat or a dog. They do need lots of time out of the cage. I explained that, like, if you kept a cat in a cage, would you just say, oh yeah, well, that's where she lives? No, same thing with a rabbit. You wouldn't put a rabbit in a cage and say, that's where they live. You want them to come out. You need time out to play and run around and they like to hang out, sit with you, watch TV. You can meet Lovebug, Clover, and a number of other adorable adoptables at the MSPCA Shelter, 1577 Falmouth Road in Centerville.